We love it when people buy Branch Basics, but we really love it when people get rid of all of the toxic cleaning products that are undermining their health. Yeah, it's one thing to purchase our product and you know, sit it next to all the other toxic products that you continue to use and think, oh, I just bought a non-toxic healthy product, it's like feeling good, home's healthier, not so much. Um, really, the idea is to take away the bad, take away the things that are creating this low level chemical soup in your home that are slowly undermining your health, the health of your loved ones, and then, oh, wait, what do I clean with? Well, we have a perfect solution, but we never set out to sell soap. We are here to help educate people on the importance of removing these toxic chemicals by sharing our story and telling you know all the incredible benefits of what it's done for each of us individually. And then, hey, we actually happen to have a kick-ass product that you can use to replace all the things you just threw out. So don't just add it, get the <laughs> other ones out. <laughs> yeah. We have to know the truth about the products in our homes. We need to know what is safe and what is not safe. If they have harmful ingredients, and they under, that undermine our health, we need to get them out. Just the simple act of getting them out of the house can dramatically improve your air quality immediately. And even yeah. the ones not being used, you know, we think, oh, well, um, you know, I use like three or four products. I'm sure it's not that bad, but so yes, that in and of itself, I mean, studies have shown that the regular use of conventional cleaning products is equivalent to smoking a pack of cigarettes a day. So that's pretty bad. But then the things that are not being used, that are gathering dust, they're also contributing parts per million, parts per billion to this low level chemical soup in your home. And Marilee has given this great analogy that we um, like to tell people, which is you walk down the cleaning product aisle and you can smell which aisle you're on. It's so pervasive. And none of these products okay. have been opened, they're sealed shut. And so on a, on a smaller scale, we are bringing these things in our home and we're asking our bodies to constantly detoxify and work through these things instead of spending this precious energy that our bodies need to either maintain health or overcome some, you know, chronic illness. And many people today are buying non-toxic products all over the place and that is great. But again, if all around your house are scattered products that undermine your health, what you're trying to do is undermine. Well, and non-toxic on the front of a label is not enough. Like you have to actually turn it around and really know what you're bringing into your home. Yeah, so. you see, caution, warning, or danger, those are key words um, because the cleaning product industry is not regulated. It's not required to list all the ingredients on the label. So that makes it hard sometimes to identify, okay, is this bad or is this good? Um, and so the key words, ca uh, caution, warning, and danger are actually legal terms, and they are triggered when certain ingredients exist in the products. So if you see caution, warning, or danger, get but it out. But also the green natural cleaners, I mean, those are worth looking up too. There's always, most likely, ingredients at the end of that list or fragrance thrown in there or whatever. So we want, we want to give you the tools to learn how to analyze those as well. And all this is so much easier than like, overcoming a sugar addiction or whatever. I mean, when you eat, you have to think of what you're gonna eat every single day, multiple times a day. It's like, you gather up all your cleaning products and you get them out one time and you're Finite done. process. Mm -hmm. And we say, we, you don't have to get your kids to drink a green smoothie. You can do yeah. this undercover. Remove yeah, these things from the house, nobody has to even know. Yeah, and, Pretty you, easy. and you help everyone in the house. So why start with cleaning? Because everybody cleans. Uh, we're not going to go, you know, start investigating your pantry or your refrigerator. We are not that that's not important, but it's awesome to start with something that is, you know, easy, it's attainable, something you can do today that really is not going to affect everyone in your home except to benefit their health. It's an easy first step that makes such a big impact.